Alright guys, so I do share a lot of arena videos on my channel and more recently I've been seeing a lot of people comment saying hey, there's so many different cons. Hey, I don't have these cookies Hey, what team should I build and in this video? I want to quickly tell you guys some of the tips that I want to give you guys as a player who's been playing for a while as well as been seeing a lot of different changes that's happening inside of the arena so First of all, I am going to be talking about some of the tips that I want to give to newer players as well as some of the tips that I want to give to older players now uh, who are able to reach a consistent rank inside of the arena. So first of all, to all of the newer players who are playing this game and do not have all of the resources uh, that you guys need to make several different teams, you guys should first be spending your resources on a one main team that you guys can use for both attack as well as defense and an example of that is going to be something like this all right so i'm going to make it actually right now so something that i would consider a standard team that you guys can use inside of the arena right now for both attack and defense is going to be something like you know having dark cow of course if you don't have dark cow then you guys can go with you know wildberry or if you do have both of them you guys can go with both double tanks however if you don't then you guys can just go with wildberry as well in the middle you have something like eclair sorbet or even pumpkin pie or you can have someone like caramel arrow uh as your dps and after you choose out one or two dps is you'll choose out your supports and that will be someone like you know right now parfait someone like pomegranate someone like content or even herb all right so what you need to figure out is you have to invest in the cookies that are going to be good for both attack and defense as well as for the world exploration because your resources are going to be limited right so make sure to find a team that is going to be working but for both attack and defense as of right now because arena is going to be two parts right you need to be able to win in your attacks to gain trophies as well as you need to win in your defense in order to not lose trophies right so you gain trophies a little bit when you guys do win your defenses but you know you your main point is to not lose any trophies while you guys are away from the game all right, so that's the reason why for newer players, you guys should be focusing on a very standard team in the beginning and then branch out to more comps like, you know, summoners right now, right? Summoners are super popular right now. It's something like this uh, very niche comp where you're going to use to counter one specific comp, like the summoner comp, right? Uh, so I've seen a lot of people saying, hey, dude, this only counters one comp. Is this going to be good for other uh, against other comps? Yeah, in a way, it might be able to be used against other other comps however inside of the arena right now it's not back in 2021 september anymore right uh you know back when hollowberry first came out and got her massive buff because of all of the uh you know adjustment that needed to be made there was only one specific comp that a lot of people use it's like you know hollowberry strawberry crepe sorbet sea fairy and pure vanilla right that is not that comp anymore it's not that season anymore there's just so many different cookies so many different comps that can be made there's comps coming out like every single day that people you know find out and that works for them and that is what you need to do as a newer player you need to make a comp that works for you all right so now that i taught that for newer players something that i want to tell the older players who are able to consistently reach a certain rank inside of the arena right now for their individual server and also if you guys are in master or even diamond and things like that you guys need to be able to set two individual teams for your attack and defense so for example here in this comp that you guys see right now in front of you guys all right so this is a comp that i shared with you guys yesterday about the one shot comp using oyster as well as twizzy gummy with seafarer and almond together in order to counter the summary comp a lot of people once again commented and said hey this comp only counters one comp and here is the thing you should not be setting this team as a defense team defense team should be used to defend against a majority or a good variety of different teams and for example for me right now this is the defense team that i'm using i'm using dark cow wallberry eclair cotton as well as oyster and this is going to be my defense team and personally speaking you know i've been having decent success on it right there's a lot of different wins there's some uh you know 
some losses that you know when a certain comp comes in i know for sure i'm losing someone like you know a sorbet comp uh there's times when i will win uh, because probably from stats and toppings like that however it is more wins uh, and personally speaking than losses right now so i am gaining trophy rather than losing more trophies right so it is two different parts for the upper race especially right so make sure you guys have two different comps that you guys can use for your defense and your offense so for example once again that twizzy comp is going to be more of an offensive build that you guys use to specifically target one comp that you guys see so if i do see something like a summoner comp right now on my board and that is when i'm going to use this comp when i see a certain other comp like a double tank comp then i'm going to go with the sorbet comp so in the upper race nowadays now you guys got to realize it's like playing rock paper scissors you need to be able to uh you know when you see a rock then you got to go with the paper if you you see a scissor then you gotta go with the rock it's pretty much now playing that sort of game you need to make sure you guys know the counter to each comp and that's why i share different videos so that you guys can counter these comps and just realize that once a video is out once uh, comps are being used more frequently then a lot more people are going to use it because you know news travels fast there's a lot of different communities you know discord neighbor you know uh other websites youtube there's so many different uh social media platform that people share comps from so just be aware that once a comp comes out there's always going to be a counter you might not always be able to win a duplicate battle because of topping differences technology differences and things like that but something that i want to tell both uh groups now is to make sure you guys enjoy the game first all right so that's going to be a really big thing don't stress out arena is one part of the game rather than being the main part of the game right so make sure to focus on other parts uh, as well there's different ways to gain crystals of course this is going to be more of the competitive aspect of the game but make sure that you guys are not stressing out when playing the game because you should be having fun when you play games right so make sure to do that as well guys but that's something that i want to quickly just let you guys know make sure to know that there's two different parts into the arena which is going to be attack and defense and for newer players to make sure to spend resources on cookies that you can use for both attack and defense and make a team like that first and then for the older players who are able to consistently reach a higher rank in the arena right now make sure to have one defense team and one attack team so that later on when you do get attacked and you guys do lose against certain team then you guys can go and do a revenge battle against a different defense team using some of the comps that you guys have that will counter a specific comp so make sure to do that guys hope you guys found the video helpful and i'll see you guys all on the next one